Hey friends! Yo, how you doing? I have just got back from Paris pretty much and it's been my birthday! Went to Paris with my mum, partly for like, well, for my birthday and also as like a mum-daughter let's have a fucking great time together, cheer up sort of thing. So we went to Paris for four days and obviously we did a bit of shopping. I posted a picture on Instagram of my shopping bag. A lot of you guys was like, whoa, show us what you bought. So I'm gonna, right, the first thing I bought is what's holding most of the stuff I bought. And this was when I went to Disneyland Paris. We were shopping at night time and we thought it'd be a good idea to buy a big bag for our hand luggage on the plane to put all excess stuff in. So I've got this big, giant Mickey Mouse bag. Whoa, it's huge for the hand luggage. And I, I know it's not like the most stylish bag ever, but oh my God, I'm so glad I bought it because I don't know what I've done because I had a little handbag on, on the way there and my suitcase. And then because obviously I've been buying stuff, I didn't want to go over the limit on my weight on my suitcase. So I put all the stuff that I bought in here. It was such a good idea. So I'm just going to use it for like, practical stuff and it's got Mickey Mouse's on it. I love Disney. This is a shop called Jeans uh, de Vivre and it's uh, basically like it was like a fragrance shop. They sell like candles and like room fragrances and lots of lovely things and I bought this really nice thing for my bedroom and the smell is cool. Quelico poppy, scented flower. So um, the idea is, you know when you get like a jar with the reeds coming out, imagine that, but instead of a jar of uh, reeds, you've got a flower which's got a rope on the end of it that dips into the fragrance, just gives off this amazing smell. It's so, so nice. I thought that Matthew would really enjoy it. But you can see the flower and the jar, and the idea is to sort of put the fragrance you know. I don't have this to show you, but we went to, we went to Laradi, which, Ladurie, keep calling it Laradi, Ladurie, which is a macaroon and shop and bakery. Amazing. Very expensive, but me and mum thought, you know what, when in Paris. We bought 15, we shared them, it was so nice. How much was it? 36 euros <laughs> for 15 macaroons. And it comes with this really pretty bag, but they were so good. We got a selection and we shared them. Oh God, so nice. We went back to our hotel, had some Prosecco, we were just eating macaroons, just like, how fancy can you get? Me and mum, mum was just loving life. It was so good, so good. I went to Sephora, only bought two things, which was very good of me, I feel, because the last two times I've been to Sephora, I've gone only with the intention of buying one thing and come out with loads of things, but I just went in for a look and a couple of things I saw in there that I really liked. First one being Narciso Rodriguez for her, and it's a selection of fragrances, miniatures. I do love this perfume, I've had it before. And you get these miniatures, so you get the Eau de Toilette, the Eau de Toilette, Eau de Parfume and Eau de Parfume Intense. And you just get these little perfumes in this box. And I, oh, I love, I love this scent so much. It's very strong, it's very like, oof. But I really, really like that one. And I also got the Coco Contour set from too Faced and it's just a contour palette. A contour and highlight palette. I'm not really into cream contours, so I've got a powdery one. It's really nice and it looks like that inside. Just thought it was really nice to get a nice little brush. So I'm excited to try this out. I got some <laughs> Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse scissors for my office from Disneyland Paris. I just thought they were really, really cute. But I, I had to put these in my suitcase. I didn't want them to think I had a weapon on the plane. I got this hat from um, this touristy shop. Well, it's not a hat, it's got a ring in it. Mum got one too, we got matching. I'll wear it now. We were getting a bit chilly and we thought that we bought, saw these and thought, oh, let, let's get them, they're really cool. So we got these, they're so, they're so cool. I also got a pair of Minnie Mouses, another pair, another set from Disneyland. I feel like every time I go, I'm gonna have to get a different set and sort of collect them collect them all. So this will be the time I went to Disneyland Paris with my mum. We got photos from when we went to Disney. Um, we got a Space Mountain one and we got Tower of Terror. I'm pretty sure I almost called my mum on this ride. She wasn't most impressed when we came off. But she loved the Tower of Terror. This is so funny. I actually almost threw up on that ride, not gonna lie. The next thing I got was a, such um, a treat. I went to Z Zadig and Voltaire and I got some stuff in their sale. Now I did go a bit mental because, well, I got some boots 
And I thought that basically these boots, the price on the ticket was them half price, but it wasn't. I got these incredible western boots with the embellishment on the back, which are the wings, and really nice stitching detail, really soft leather, so beautiful, this nice dud effect. They're just, they're just so beautiful and anyway, so because I thought that the price on the ticket was them with the reduction, when I got to the till and was, and she said it was, you know, half that, I was like, oh so I went back to the sale bit, so quickly can I pick something out, and I got a beautiful rose gold purse, which has, which looks like that inside, and again it has the wing, wings embellishment on there as well. So pretty, I, I love rose gold. So I got this as well, which is also half price. I went to MAC with mum. Mum bought a little lip gloss. I bought, not that exciting, but I got a lipstick and a lip liner. The only things I've ever bought from MAC have been lip products. I really want to try their foundations, but I'm a bit scared to steer away from the one that I really like using all the time, which is L'Oreal Matching Minerals. Obviously that does everything in one, whereas for foundations you've got a powder, you've got like concealers, all this sort of stuff, and I'm a bit scared of having to faff around with all those when I've already got a product that I really like. But I really do want to try some sort of more high-end foundations, just see what it's like. But anyway, I got a MAC lip liner in the colour Cherry. And to go with that, because they didn't have the lipstick colour in the lip liner, so this is very close to this colour, I got um, Retro Matte in Ruby Woo. I did have this colour when I was at Disney World in Orlando. It melted and I had to chuck it out. And it's just a really nice red. I don't have a red lipstick. This colour here is this weird gloss stuff that goes matte but it's really messy and just can look a bit shit. So <laughs> I just wanted to say that's easy. Like quickly pop on. So I've got a lip liner and I've got the lipstick. I got my favourite snack from France. Junoir Cerise and these are like these are like jammy dodgers, but it's an inside is cherry and it's got a white chocolate topping. Oh my god, I love these so much. Basically, a whole packet is eaten in one go. They, you just can't stop eating them when you when you get them. They're so Moorish and so good. On my birthday day, I woke up in the morning and me and mum um, had some breakfast delivered to our room. In one of my cards, I had some. My sister put some euros in there to get something, so I bought myself Marie from the Aristocats. Do me so do do so di do. Every truly cultured music student knows you must use your scales and your arpeggios. Bring the music ringing from your chest and not your nose while you sing your scales and your arpeggios. <laughs> I hope I sang it right. And then because my mum basically for my birthday she paid for the Disney day. She like paid for us to go to Disney and food when we were there and she just said do you want anything from the gift shop? So I was like oh if you're sure thanks mummy. Minnie Mouse onesie. So it's a onesie but the hood is this. Minnie Mouse head is really really cool. Just thought it was ridiculous and awesome and I can spend my days lounging around in it. I love Disneyland. I'm so happy I spent my actual birthday there. It was a dream come true. It was just so nice. I always get so emotional when I go. Oh yeah, and there's one thing else that I bought. Disneyland Paris. But someone's gonna have to show you what that is. My Anna doll. And how happy did that make you? Very happy. It's no, it's lovely. How much do you love Frozen? Like, a lot. How many times? It's my favourite. How many times did you watch Frozen when I was away? About three times. Well, yeah. what did you do yesterday? Um, bought Elsa <laughs> to go with her and bought it on DVD, on Blu-ray. DVD. So yes, now he has Olaf, Anna, and a matching Elsa, and it on DVD. She's well nice though. <laughs> Mum thinks he has issues. <laughs> but that is it, that's what I got in Paris. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll um, see you guys soon. Bye!